Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I truthfully don't think that I've been this excited for a video, but as you can tell by the title, I'm throwing my mom a surprise 60th open house birthday party. I've been planning it for like the last year. It's October, which means it's party month. I'm pretty much just going to be filming the whole month of October because October is officially like her birthday month. Her birthday's on the 13th, but the party is on the 26th. This video is just going to be a party vlog. Welcome to it. In this video, you will actually see like the party, the actual day of, the food, how it turned out, which I hope is good. I don't really know yet. So yeah, I just wanted to say welcome to the video. Don't forget to subscribe to join the family. You may have noticed that I have combined this channel with my husband. We're pretty much making it like a couple's channel. So yeah, I also wanted to address that. But with all of that being said, let's just go ahead and get into the party prep. While I'm filming, I also wanted to just show you guys this product I got on Amazon. It's a really cool like shoe organizer, but I just thought it was so cute. It has like these magnets. It just came in today, so I wanted to like show you guys. I'm really excited to use this probably downstairs because we have a bunch of shoes that we need to organize. I just thought it was really cute. Got it off of Amazon. The brand is called Flexi Mount. I'll have it right here and also in the link in the description box if you guys want to check it out and get one. So cute. So I'm... <laughs> Stop. I have a backstory of how we're surprising her. She has absolutely no clue. I have been planning this party for about a year, which is insane, but I've never done something like this. I work full time. I just need a lot of time. It's like two weeks out now. Like I said, her birthday was on the 13th and so I didn't want her to get suspicious if we just like didn't do anything. So I made her dinner at her house and we like opened gifts. Like we just kind of celebrated her birthday like we would normally so that she wouldn't get suspicious of this huge party. And I don't think she'll be expecting it because it'll be two weeks after her birthday. So I just finished up work and then I just finished cutting hair and everything and we're getting ready to hop in the truck and go to like five different Dollar Trees to get all of the glassware. So then in here it is an absolute wreck. I'm going to show you guys all of this party stuff that I have and like what the plan is. I have been washing these tablecloths, ironing them all, drying them, everything. It has literally taken me all day because there's eight. They're like the floor length ones. They're huge. I can only wash two at a time. I've done like four loads of laundry, dried them. It takes me 30 minutes to iron one tablecloth. I got a head start and I already did five. That took me the entire day. I only have three more to iron. They're all washed and dried, but I will show you all the party stuff later and kind of tell you like what the plan is, what we're doing. We also stopped by a Dollar Tree yesterday and got all of this, which was hard task but at one dollar true we got all of these black mugs we really wanted to do glass for my mom she just loves having glassware we didn't want to get like plastic it's a little bit more expensive but it's just going to be worth it because look at these black mugs so classy we have these glass little like wine glasses but we're just using them for like water we are getting ready to hit up every single dollar tree in our area in hopes of finding the total number of mugs glasses and plates I'll keep you updated. Okay, we just got back from all of the stores. It's 9.53, so it definitely took us quite a while. We ended up going to three Dollar Trees and then Party City. I actually have a class that I'm taking every night at 10 p.m. from 10 to 11 p.m. We had to rush home to do that. I haven't even had dinner yet. I'm gonna go ahead and hop on my class because it's starting now, and then I will catch you guys up on everything we bought tonight. As it is the next day. We just got back from running so many errands, I feel like we just went everywhere. I want to catch you guys up on everything that we have and then also just kind of the plan for the party. It's 7.20. It has literally been insane, you guys. I'm gonna walk you through like just my week so that you can kind of see how it's been the last two weeks. Just starting with last Monday, every single day last week, I would work 7.30 to 4 p.m. and then I would have a client come over and I did not finish until 8 or 8 30 p.m every single night last week my husband and i went to party city the dollar tree we've been getting all of the dishes from the dollar tree as soon as i was done with work i would rush to go to the dollar tree get as many dishes we run to the next dollar tree turned out we could only go to like two before they closed since we were getting there so late i would come home because i've been in a class from 10 p.m to 11 p.m it's like a zoom meeting 
So we have literally been running from one place to the next the past two or three weeks just trying to get everything here like at my house. I don't think I realized how big this is like having a surprise party because it's just like so much that goes into it and I've never done something like this. So today is Thursday night. I'm ironing tablecloths right now. I just had a huge Amazon order come in from for stuff. Starting tonight, I don't have any more clients after work until the party because it is just full on party mode, whatever. I got so nervous because I thought my mom was going to show up here today and we have so many dishes and party stuff spread throughout the house. I wanna kinda tell you guys the theme so that you can kind of see what I'm working with. I'll explain to you what I have. So I'm gonna put it like right here. But this is my little Pinterest board for the party. I'm making these little prosciutto toast, like appetizer sliders, fudge brownies, cranberry and orange mocktail drink, which is different, but I'm gonna try to do that. Cucumber water, just plain black coffee, espresso cheesecake, with ganache, just like little bites. Autumn squash soup, she loves Panera's autumn squash soup. Blackberry, balsamic, bruschetta, toast appetizer things with whipped ricotta. Shrimp cucumber bites, shrimp cocktail, salmon rolls, these little individual Caesar salads, steak bites wrapped in bacon. The theme I'm going for for the food, like I just want it to be very pretty and clean tomato mozzarella bites. I am gonna do some homemade creme brulees, crab cake bites, Zuppa Toscana because she also loves that, cucumber tea sandwiches, and crab stuffed mushrooms. That's the menu that I'm going to try to make. We're gonna see if I can actually do all of that. Everything's gonna be black and gold. We have these very long, beautiful tablecloths that I actually used for our wedding. I had to sneak over to my mom's house while she was at work one day to grab them. I just now placed an order for some candles and some fairy lights. And the way we're gonna get her there is pretty much up to my dad. The venue that we are using is downtown. It's right next to a coffee place, like a coffee shop. The plan is for him to say like, hey, we didn't get to celebrate that much on your actual birthday, which was just last week. So I'm gonna take you to like a fancy dinner. So she's gonna get all dressed up for a fancy dinner. And then he's just gonna like accidentally open the door to the venue which is just right next to like the coffee shop another restaurant it'll be fine she's just gonna be like what is this like is this a new place and walk in and we're all gonna be there i'm gonna block out my number and the address but this is a little invitation so it says formal attire so everyone is gonna be like all dressed up she loves to get dressed up also she loves to try different foods so that is why the menu is very big and also different she just loves to try new things and she also loves seafood so that's i think the whole plan of the night it's an open house i want to start showing you guys some things i ordered a big sign okay so this is actually perfect i think it's gonna work out really good I'm not like taking this off yet. It's like a little, I don't know, a little protector over the sign, but you can kind of see it says, oh, it says welcome to Angela's 60th birthday party. The easel is perfect. The sign is perfect. Okay, next I went to Party City and got these little martini glasses. And this is what I'm gonna put the Caesar salads in. So it looks like this. I have two boxes of these from Amazon. Just like the picture I showed you, they are these little glasses for the Caesar dressing. So they're gonna be like, kinda like this. These are gonna be for the little shrimp cocktails that I showed you. Just like a little glass like that. And I'm gonna have, I got these toothpicks and I'm just gonna put like a couple shrimp on these and then just have some dipping sauce in there. So that's all of that. Someone already stopped off a present. She's not gonna be able to come to the party but she already dropped off a present which is super nice. Then we got some spoons and forks. These are just black ones. Skewers. I got these little signs to put in front of the food so that people can see what it actually is. Napkins. Just a bunch of little black napkins. And then I got these cute little spoons for the creme brulees. This is a state of the rest of the house. It's kind of crazy. I'm currently washing all of these dishes. Got them in here. 
I'm about to take these out and put these inside of it to get them washed and I think that's the last batch. They're literally over here. I have more over here. These are all from the Dollar Tree. I think they're gorgeous. We just got black mugs, black drinkware, then we have black plates. So pretty. And then we have these little bowls for the soup. Then we went to the Dollar Tree again and got these, which we're going to spray paint this pretty like sparkly gold color. We're going to spray paint them and then put fairy lights inside. Then we're going to have candles everywhere, more mugs. And then we have these totes that we bought to transport all the dishes. So we went to Ace Hardware and got those. We got this really pretty serving platter. We got another one in here, which I'll show you. More martini glasses. I'm not going to unwrap it, but you can kind of see. It's like a mirror. I think it's really pretty. Stuff for the cream and sugar, which I'll take them out and show you. But that was everything we got today. grocery trip which I will show you everything that we got. I just want to update you on everything that we've pretty much done. It's been quite a few late nights. Yesterday night I went to my grandma's house, borrowed all of her glassware like for platters and like tongs and things for the food. I do remember now the night that we were packing all of the glassware we found out at like midnight that we were going to need to go to Maryland the next morning. So we literally like went straight to bed, packed up like the house was clean and everything. We packed up all of the dishes and then the next day we spent the entire day in Maryland. So it was a long road trip. We got back home at midnight. I'm not even exaggerating. So that day was completely gone. I've just been playing catch up since then. Also wanted to show you guys what I'm possibly going to be wearing. This one you can't really tell, but it's like a little satin halter top dress from Altered State. This one is really, really pretty. It's from Versona, a longer dress. Depending on the weather will determine what I wear. I also went to Nordstrom when we were in Maryland and I got the cutest earrings. So they're really cool and it has like these sparkles and the back of the earring is actually like the sparkle chain. So I got that from Maryland and then I also got this ring in Maryland at Nordstrom. I'm probably going to wear this jewelry and then I have these really pretty earrings that I got. Got these at Express and then these are the shoes I got from DSW. So they're just like these classic pumps. I didn't have any like black pumps, so I'm gonna wear these probably with either one of the dresses. I also stopped by Ulta and got some Loving Tan, which I've never used before, but I used it on myself last night. I feel like I look a little bit darker. I think I'm gonna go ahead and use that Loving Tan, which I'll show you the kind that I got. Yeah, I got the dark kind of the Two Hour Express Loving Tan, and then I have this that I already used, Josie Moran. 
Argan Liquid Gold Self Tanning Oil. So I put this on my legs and I put this everywhere else. So far, I really like this one better. This Loving Tan is just like, it doesn't go on as smooth. It tends to like grab in different areas. I don't know. I'm testing that out. The last thing I got just for like cosmetics is some foundation because I have not worn foundation in probably two or three years. I've just been wearing concealer. This is the Neutrogena kind and it's in the level 60. So I'm actually wearing that now, just kind of testing it out like I said. And I really like it, so. And then this is everything we have packed up for the parties. We have these drink stands and then two crock pots because we're having soup. We have this coffee urn for the coffee. And then all of this stuff is like platters and in here is like for the coffee bar but i also bought this from tj maxx we're already starting to pack everything up and then in here is all of the groceries it's kind of insane i have not gone through everything yet but we have all of this like this is crazy that's all the groceries i'm gonna go through kind of like organize everything we just have a lot of stuff going on i'm gonna start by putting all of this stuff away also grant brought me these gorgeous flowers these are gonna look so pretty on my black kitchen table these are my favorite so i'm gonna put these in a vase later on my mom's friend that is coming in from out of town is gonna stay here for like a couple hours when they come in from their road trip i want to have the house pretty much clean and like looking good for when they stop by they're gonna like freshen up and change from their road trip so they can go straight to the venue when it's time i want to have everything like clean and ready so now i'm getting ready to clean out my fridge so that i have room to put everything Okay, I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna clean out my fridge. Welcome to the inside of my fridge. minutes later i have all of the fridge stuff put away like the stuff that goes in the fridge i'm probably just going to organize the food on the kitchen table to get it kind of out of my way all the groceries and stuff up. These are my flowers. Okay, I just started some laundry. I put away all... Did you just ask Alexa to close the door? Pause the music. <laughs> I heard close the door. This is the state of our fridge. It's literally shoved all the way back there. Our table is completely full of stuff. It doesn't need to be refrigerated and this is just all food that I don't have a spot for. And I'm gonna be cooking all day on Friday and Saturday anyways. But look how good my flowers look. I think they're so pretty. Plan for the rest of the week is we did the bulk of all of our shopping tomorrow night is wednesday and i'm gonna have to work all day and then we're gonna go to kroger and fresh market to get all of the seafood and thursday night i'm gonna start cooking some stuff friday is gonna be my big cooking day i'm also gonna clean the whole house i'm going to do my nails my toes i'm gonna fake tan 
Friday is just gonna be a really big day. Hopefully load up the truck. Saturday, I have a few things to prep that morning, so I do have some cooking to do. And we can't get to the venue until 4 p.m. because they're having a party beforehand so we can get there like right at 4. It starts at 5.30, not a lot of time. Everyone's gonna get there at like 5.30 and then my mom's gonna get there at 6. So we have a lot of stuff to do, but yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> 